Hello, today I'm going to show you the parts of a Chicago Manual of Style or CMS citation for an article from a database. After watching this, you'll be able to create a citation on your own. Let's get started. Here we have a citation for an article that we've received from a database. The parts of this citation include the author name, the name of the article, the journal title, the volume and issue number of the journal, the publication date, the pages in which the article appears, the database that the article was retrieved from, and a URL to the database. Let's take a closer look at these parts. We'll start with the author name. Last name first, followed by a comma, then the first name, followed by a period. Next, include the article title. Be sure to enclose the article title in quotations. Within the quotations and after the article title, also include a comma. Also note that most of the words within this article title have been capitalized. Next, include the journal title, being sure to italicize the title of the journal. In Chicago Manual of Style, you can single space your citations. Be sure to do what's called a hanging indent on subsequent lines. This just means to bring over your indent about four places. Also, between entries in your reference list, double space. The next portion of this citation is the volume number and the issue number. Note that between the volume number and the issue number, there is a comma. And preceding the issue number, there is an abbreviation for the word number, N-O period. Next, include within your parentheses the publication date. This will always include a year, but sometimes may include a season or a month. After the publication date, include a colon. Next, include the page range where the article appears, starting with the first page where the article appears and ending where the last page of the article appears. Within those two numbers, include a dash, and after the last page, include a period. Next, be sure to include the name of the database where you retrieved the article. Follow this information with a comma. Finally, include a web address where you can access the database. And that's how easy it is to create a citation using Chicago Manual of Style for a journal article that you've retrieved from a database. If you have questions about Chicago Manual of Style, stop by the library's reference department. We're located on the first floor of the Great Graniteville Library or give us a call at 803-643-6808. You can also visit us on the web at library.usca.edu. Thanks for listening.